Today, we are gonna take a tour of all the different shopping areas here in and around the 56 freeway. We've taken a lot of tours of the neighborhoods, but we haven't really dove too deep into the shopping areas here. We're gonna start in Carmel Valley at Juan Paseo, which is right behind me. So Juan Paseo pretty much has everything you need here in San Diego. It's probably one of the most beautiful shopping centers in all of San Diego, especially along the 56 freeway. It has everything you need, including a great happy hour at Nick's Del Mar. Or how about some meats at the butchery? If you're looking for some international barbecue, check out International Smoke. If you're looking to satisfy your sweet tooth, check out Suzy Cakes. That's where I got my wedding cake, as well as Harlan Brewing, one of the best brewing places around here. And this is where I get my blowouts at the dry bar. If you're looking for a gift for your significant other or kids, this store Pigment right behind me has really good gifts. And we're gonna take a little tour of the store right now and see what it's all about. You select all the plants that you'd like. We'll show you how to plant everything, keep care of it. The maintenance on this. Water every three to four weeks, depending on where you put it in the house. So I don't really have to do that much? Nope. That sounds great. <laughs> Next stop on our shopping center tour in around 56, we're at the Del Mar Highland Shopping Center. This is probably one of the biggest shopping centers in the area, but first we're gonna have to get a little pit stop and check out the donut scene here in Carmel Valley. Let's go take a look. People always ask me, why do we always stop at donut shops in our tours? Well, mainly it's because we really like donuts. And apparently we do talk about donuts too much because there's a huge line outside sidecar donuts, but hopefully we can get a donut. I don't think I've ever had a donut with a cookie dough ball on top of it, and I'm really excited about it. Oh my god, it's heavy. <laughs> it's like one of the heavier donuts I've had. I'm really excited. <laughs> Is that a phone call? <laughs> yeah, can't enter it right now. Sorry, clients. Salted caramel cookie dough donut is the best donut I've ever had. I'm just gonna put it out there. Oh my God, it's like a party in my mouth. That's a big coat. You had a lot of donuts in the show, and this is the best donut. It's got some chocolate chips in it, salted caramel on it, and it has a cookie dough ball on top of it. It's ridiculous. And one of the best things about Sidecar Donuts, which is one of our favorite donut shops here in San Diego, is they change their donuts on a monthly basis. So you never get tired of one. They always bring out someone new. They also have vegan choices for our vegans out there. It's just a magical place. You should check it out. So one of the newest additions to Del Mar Highland Shopping Center is the Sky Deck here right behind me. It's a great restaurant with the Brewer's Deck. It looks amazing. So if you're ever looking for like a day night or even just take the kids for a spot to go, it's a great place to check out. So the next stop on our tour is the Del Sur Town Center here in Del Sur. It serves the area of Del Sur, Forest Ranch. So if you're new to San Diego or thinking about moving to San Diego, you might not be aware that San Diego has a huge biking community. There's plenty of places you can go. There's street biking, there's beach cruising along the, the beach there in like Mission Beach, or there's a bunch of mountain biking trails here in San Diego. So there's a little bit for everybody and you might see a bike shops such as this bike shop at Del Sur and a lot of the shopping centers here in the area. Del Sur Town Center here is not one of the biggest shopping centers here around here, but they do have some great food options. So right next to us, we have Piacere Mio, which actually first opened in South Park and it's worked its way up here to uh, the North County, as well as Ponce's, which actually started down in Kensington. So these aren't your typical chain restaurants you might see in the suburbs. And one of my wife's favorites, Target. All right, next stop on our tour is the Pacific Highland Ranch Shopping Center. This center was built about five years ago and it's got a lot of good options here. It's got Pacific Social, which is one of our favorite restaurants here in the area. It's got a big arcade area on the top floor where your kids can go play while you're enjoying your food and beverage. Just next door to there, they have Breakfast Republic, which you actually did a video on that not too long ago. You can see it up, up here in the corner. And then they got a ramen place across the street and then a Mexican restaurant called Death by Tequila, which I have not tried yet because it's only been there for a few months. And just across the street, they're opening up a new Korean fried chicken place called Banchan. So I'm looking forward to checking that out too. Just off the strip over here, a lot of the single family homes here. So if you live in this area, you can walk to the center. And just behind us here is the Pacific Highland Rec Center. So they got, uh, the, there's the uh, middle school back there as well as Canyon Crest Academy and a huge park back there with a, a pump track as well. So it's a very cool place to check out. You go here for lunch or dinner and then kind of work your way out there for the kids to run around and play. Summertime, they also do movie nights in the park here. So it's a really good vibrant place here, especially on the weekends. 
So the last stop on our tour is the Carmel Mountain Ranch Shopping Center here in Carmel Mountain Ranch. This is kind of right at the corner of the 56 and the 15 freeway. This is kind of the, the biggest shopping area in the area. It's home to all your big box stores, like your Best Buys, your Costco's, we got Dick's Sporting Goods here. So anything you guys need to, to buy for your house, this is pretty much the spot to go. They have an at-home furniture store here and obviously the Costco down the road that has all your toilet paper and paper towels that you could use. There's also a lot of chain food restaurants here. So this is where you go to In-N-Out Burger, which pretty much always has a long line here. Then my kids spend a lot of time at this uh, yogurt shop right over here, Tutti Frutti Frozen Yogurt. Another great spot that we liked coming here for is the Angelica Movie Theater in here. It's one of those dine-in movie theaters with reclining seats. They also serve uh, alcoholic beverages, but they are quite expensive. If you want a beer there, it costs about $10 a beer. Just sneak in your beer or your alcoholic beverages and you will be much more happy by the end of the movie. And this is actually one of the more affordable spots probably along the 56 freeway. Carmel Mountain Ranch average, I mean, the median home price is not cheap by any means, but around 900,000 is the median home price which for this area is actually relatively affordable. So good spot to live, especially if you wanna be in the Poway Unified School District as well. So that was our tour of all the shopping areas here in and around the 56 freeway. Thought this might be helpful for anybody that's moving to the area, see what it's all about, not just the neighborhoods. We also a lot of shopping to do here, a lot of restaurants, uh, a lot of parks, so a lot to see here. And if this is your first time to our channel, please subscribe to our channel as we post new videos every week. And if you're looking to move to San Diego, we'd love to find you your next home. Thanks for watching, catch us next week, bye.